Okay, gang, thanks for coming in on such short notice. We have a big problem, and we need solutions. Oh, no, did we send out more figures where the arms break off when you take them out of the package? Hey, at least the legs didn't come off this time. What do these adult toy buyers want from us? No, there's no time in that. It seems our new manager of shipping has shipped out two of the $300 Ninja Turtle Lab playsets in each order. Sir, the shipping address on these are the same ones we shipped out. Just ship it. I got a Fortnite game I gotta get back to. So how do we fix this? Didn't we just double ship an ugly ass Beetlejuice doll? You don't understand how hard it is to ship out toys, do you? We have to get the order address for the computer IT department down to the warehouse, all in 14 weeks. They knew those shipping orders down to the shipping dock as soon as possible. I'll get to it. I'm trying to watch some Adam Gold videos. So everyone got two of them? We made double the amount? No, you idiot! We made 20% less than what was ordered, and over half of the people will not get one! Hey, what's the problem? We will get those 300 lab sets back and into the hands of the ones that wanted them before they realize it's a $40 play set with no functions and they demand their money back! Sir, if we take the office phone off the hook and not check the emails, we'll never ever have to give them a refund! We've been doing that for years, Francis! Why don't we just ask the buyers who got two of them to return it? Have FedEx pick it up at their house and give them an extra $100 store credit as a thank you. What's wrong with you? We screwed up, not them. Why should we give them $100? We could send them all an email and tell them they'll go to jail for 200 years if it's not returned by December 1st. That's too extreme. But I do love the idea of threatening the adult toy buyers. Let's send them an email and tell them if they don't get off their fat asses and mail it back, we'll charge their credit card $300. Is that legal? I'll make it legal. What about the $100 store credit? Yeah, make it for Ninja Turtle items only, and then we'll have the IT guy market it sold out. Sir, you are a genius. Mattel, Hasbro, Playmates, they all wish they had a CEO like you. So is the FedEx going to pick it up their house? I mean, we just can't have random FedEx guys going to strangers' homes. What if they have a mega flag out front? I don't feel comfortable having them knock on those doors. No, guys. We'll demand that they take them to the FedEx shipping location. I like UPS. Can't we just use the old-fashioned United States Post Office service? At that shipping rate, it'll kill our overhead. Sir, I got a plan to get us out of the red on this double shipment issue. Let's hear it. We buy, mistake, double charge their credit card, even if they do return it. Give this man a raise, I love it! can we just ask them to return it, and if they don't, we say I hope you enjoy your free gift, as it was our screw up and not theirs? What the fuck is wrong with you? They will fuck up my 56 million dollar yearly bonus if we don't get that money back by the end of the year! So how do we make sure this never happens again? Don't worry, my son has been hired to take over all shipping orders. <laughs> so that's it. We demand they return it or they will get charged. Fear is how we get those labs back. Fear of double paying. Fear of never being able to get a NECA toy again. Fear is how we win. Fear, 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 f